Welcome, Puerto Cantores family, choristers, parents, family members, and choir directors to this watch party for our inaugural American Federation Puerto Cantores Virtual Choral Festival. My name is Paul French, and I'm the music director at Our Lady of Mount Carmel Church in Chicago, and also the president of the board of directors of the American Federation Puerto Cantores. Puerto Cantores is the student choral organization of the Catholic Church, and tens of thousands of singers participate in their Puerto Cantores affiliated choirs in nearly 40 countries around the world. Through the medium of sacred music, young people can deepen their relationship to God and the church and enrich their lives through the beauty of song. For the second year in a row, this COVID pandemic necessitated that we cancel our in-person choral festivals. And though we are working diligently to put the final touches on plans for our 2022 festival season, and surely looking forward to welcoming back choirs to those in-person festival events, we needed to find a way to gather these young singers this year. And thus we created this virtual choral festival event. These wonderful young singers from parishes and school choirs around the United States came together on Saturday, May 22nd, to spend the day in rehearsal, polishing their choral works and creating their own individual choral videos. The choristers were paired together in grades three and four, in grades five and six, in grades seven and eight. And each spent the festival afternoon working with a wonderful guest conductor. In today's watch party, we are delighted to present the fruits of their labors in these virtual choir festival videos. Enjoy. Greetings to all of you, our Puer Cantores community of singers, families, and friends. I'm Bishop David Zubik of the Diocese of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, and I have the happy task of serving as Episcopal moderator for the American Federation of Puer Cantores. I'm very pleased to welcome you to this virtual choir festival watch party today. We've been enjoying many wonderful videos showcasing the beautiful singing of parish and social school choir singers all across the country. Now, together, we share in the unveiling of the completed virtual choir festival that each of them had a hand and voice in creating. To all of our singers, I'm proud of the efforts you invested and I want to encourage you to continue to share your voices in your parish choirs, in your school choirs, in your community, and always for the honor and glory of God. On this day, the memorial of the Immaculate Heart of the Blessed Virgin Mary, let us begin this joyous festival in prayer. Let us pray. Loving God, your Holy Spirit brings all the baptized into one family. May we care for each other with the same devotion with which Mary cared for Jesus. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. In honor of our Blessed Mother, let us pray together. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And may God bless you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. And may dear Mother Mary continue to protect you under the mantle of her love. Amen. Enjoy this virtual choir festival. Hi, my name is Ryan. I'm 14 and I'm from Grand Rapids, Michigan. Singing is a way I can express myself and it's my passion. And I love to sing because it makes me feel like it's just me and God and the music. Singing, what singing means to me is um, giving off God's talent and how I can um, singing with God's praises, doing choir like I did this year, and joining St. Francis School with doing it. 
Hello, my name is Samantha Rodriguez. I'm 13 years old. I live in Chicago, Illinois, and I represent St. Edith's Children's Choir. Singing is very important to me because it helps me express my emotions. It helps bring me closer to God, and when I sing to God, it makes me feel very enlightened, and it's a beautiful feeling. Hello, my name is Ezra Quintero, and one of my favorite things about singing is that it gives me a lot of passion and joy, and it allows me to express myself in the best way I can. Hi, my name is Leah, I am 12 years old, and singing means family to me because my whole family sings and I come from a very musical family. Whenever we get together, that's mainly how we get together is by singing. What I like about choir is it makes me smile to sing and I love hearing all the voices together in a, one big harmony. It's so pretty. Hello, my name is Dylan. I love being in choir because the socialization it gives us is really nice. Like you get to talk with your friends during, before and after choir and even people you don't really know that much. It's more fun to learn about stuff that happened in the Bible if you're seeing it instead of just reading it out of a book at religion class. Hi, my name is Sydney. Um, I really, really love singing because it just opens my heart a lot. My favorite part of choir is um, getting to be with my friends and hearing the sound of the piano is like my favorite beat just because it sounds really pretty. My name is Micah. I am 10 years old and I live in Los Angeles. My favorite part about being in the choir is learning new songs and learning new tips for singing. Hi, I'm Leonardo Tominas. I'm 10 years old and I'm from Holy Family Grade School. My favorite part about being in the concert course is being able to learn different types of songs and have fun with the other students there. You can also learn more about music in the concert course and that's why I like being a part of it.
Hi, my name is Didi. Music strengthens my faith because I love the way everything flows together. And I like to imagine God listening to us sing, and that makes me feel closer to Him. I like singing because I like the way everything sounds, and I can express what I'm singing in any emotion. My favorite part about being in a car is that everyone has something they can improve, and so we can work on it all together. I'm Fatima. I am 9 years old. I live in Santa Ana. The reason why I love to sing is because I bring joy to God. Bless the Lord, oh my soul, oh my soul, how I worship your holy name. My name is Kendra, and I love singing because perfecting a song makes me feel really good. I like taking part in choir because I like being part of a bigger whole and singing with friends. And I feel that singing has strengthened my faith because, as St. Cecilia said, singing is doubly praying. Hi, my name is Coco, and I love singing because it inspires me to do what I love. Music strengthens my faith because it gives me more courage to share my voice with others and share what I have to say. Hello, my name is McKenna Kelly, and I love to sing because I love to express my faith that way. I also believe that all singing is beautiful, and it is a great way to express feelings and appreciate my Catholic faith. Music has strengthened my faith because music taught me how to love one another and how beautiful it is when choir groups, groups join together to sing in Mass. Singing as a cantor and in choir helps me understand more and more about God every day and when I sing, and I only think about God's love for us. Hello, I am Nate Spencer Fabian, eight years old from Los Angeles. I love singing because it makes me happy and expresses my feelings. Hi, I'm Luke, I'm 13, and I'm from Door, Michigan. I love to sing because I don't have to impress anyone, and it makes me feel like I'm levitating off the ground, and I'm in my own zone, and I'm able to just be with me and God. Hi, my name is Fatima Quesada and I'm 10 years old and I live in Jorba Linda, California. I like to sing because it makes me happy.
My name is Michael. I'm 11. I live in Chicago. The last time I sang was at a, a festival last year with lots of kids my age. I didn't realize that I missed singing until I started to practice the music for this virtual festival. I wish we were singing in person. The reason why I enjoy singing is it distracts me from all the other things that might be going on in my life. It provides a calm sense of enjoyment, and it's just my escape from reality. Hi, my name is Isabella Lopez. I'm 12 years old, and I live in Valencia, California. What I love about singing is it lifts my spirit and makes me happy. I enjoy especially being part of a choir because I'm with my friends, and I represent my school and my Catholic faith. Being a part of a choir means being a positive role model for your school and your community. Thank you.
Greetings, Puri Cantores choristers, directors, family members, and all who have shared in this virtual choir festival watch party. I'm Father James Conlon, pastor of St. Francis of Assisi Parish here in Ann Arbor, Michigan, and a board member of the American Federation of Puri Cantores. I know that you have enjoyed this online festival and once again, congratulations to all of our youth choirs and to all those who created, organized, and led this great virtual event. St. Paul, in his second letter to the Corinthians, reminds us that we are ambassadors for Christ. So can I ask you to be an ambassador for Christ through your participation in and support of the work of the American Federation? Today's festival, a virtual festival, reminds us of the good work that we seek to do, giving voice to our Catholic faith and the opportunity to all our young people from across these United States to share and use their gifts and talents for the glory of God. In his opening prayer, Bishop Zubik, our Episcopal moderator, reminded us that we are part of one great family, united through song and service, and he encouraged us to continue to share those gifts to be ambassadors for Christ's love through song. And that's our mission. It's the mission of the American Federation right across these United States from Los Angeles to Washington, D.C., from Chicago to Houston, Texas. One family united in faith and in song. Today's festival party reminds us of that truth. And with a song in our hearts, we thank God for that unity and the purpose that unites us. And so let us pray. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. God bless you all.